What's going on, buddy? My name is Elephant, and welcome back to yet another reaction video. Right, today I got another Thomas the Train video for you guys, but big but it's by Daylight Three. Uh, this video also came out at the time that my computer decided to, my motherboard decided to clonk out on me. If you didn't know what was going on, go and re watch the last reaction video I made because I explained it all there. Uh, I might make make a, sh make a short little animation explaining the whole situation, but eh, I don't know. We'll see. Um, so this is, a, from what I've read, I saw a community tab the other day from Daylight 3 saying that this is a part of a horror series he's writing. Because I remember the Henry's Forest video was uh, some of his own original work. Despite so say some influences from a actual season five, or no season four episode from the show, and my me my knee just popped. I don't know if my microphone picked it up, but this came out about maybe two weeks ago, I think three weeks ago. So right when my computer clonked out, and we're just gonna go ahead and click play on this bad boy. This is the missing four one one. I don't remember what engine that was, but we'll find out in a second. So. We could play in this bad boy in three, two, one, and the lawn mo the leaf blower guys left, so I can continue making videos for the rest of the day. Go. If you don't understand the context behind that, go watch the last episode. I got to turn this down a little bit. That is really loud. Hi, Oliver. Bill Ben. I forgot that they made the it's one of the twin the twins blue in an episode of CGI. I hated that. I forgot who was the 411. In Thomas the Train. Or even if there was, I don't remember. I'm not that disconnected from the show. It's just that I don't remember the classes of every single engine. And from the thumbnail, it looked like Gordon. So maybe he's the 411? I could be wrong. Oh, Edward. Hello, Edward. The flying Kipper crash theme. Oh, no, not Flying Kipper crash. It's Henry's um, sad theme. God, I've heard this music before. I just couldn't remember the name of it for the likes of me. Mail train? I think I need to turn up the quality a little bit. Hold on. Now I know that you all have had a there long night, but last night's storm has caused a terrible mess. Most standard services have been cancelled indefinitely. We will be working to restore the railway to operation. Thomas, you will be assisting in repairs from Ellsbridge to Farquhar. Edward, Henry, and Gordon, you will be assisting with repairs and maintenance in and around Henry's Forest. But, sir, who will run the express? Now, Gordon, it would be reckless for me to allow you to run the express now. The storm has caused much confusion and delay across the island. The main lines are in no condition for regular service. If I were to allow such runs before repairs are completed, you could have a serious accident. Remember what happened when you went down that branch line at 70 miles per hour? <laughs> I do. That farmer does, and so does his lawyers. I don't need another lawsuit, Gordon. <laughs> yes, sir. My apologies. Yes, I knew you would see reason. Now then. <laughs> that was a good episode. See you the sixth help episode. Repair the viaduct. Percy, you will help with repairs and reconstruction of Dry Air Airbase. Dolby, you will help Mavis clear debris and make repairs to a Norfolk quarry. Emily, you will be helping to clear the landslide on the Kirk Ronan branch. I expect you all to work safely. Good question for the Thomas community, and I don't remember this because I never watched the CGI. Did they ever make the Coke Kirk Roman branch official in the show? I don't remember, so if you can answer that for me, that would be thankful. Oh I don't remember I don't remember it being a thing in the model series. Thoughts of my favorite line being in ruins. Don't worry, Henry. Soon we will have the forest looking good as new. Oh, 
Oh, this rain is dreadful. I say, shouldn't the storm have ended by now? I talked with Harvey on the way here today. He said that the worst of the storm had passed, but it might double back. I wish this wretched weather would soon dissipate. Working in the forest with the mud and dirt is not a duty befitting an express engine such as myself. Don't worry, Gordon. This work will not go on forever. Hey, Daylight 3, if you want voice acting, let me know. I'm, I'm always down. The work is halfway oh done. You can take your express as soon as Rocky and Harvey clear the line. Whenever it is, I hope it is soon. <clears throat> The coastal run fell apart. The viaduct. Oh, that looks like the ep episode from season two. There. This is the last load. I have delivered the last supply train of the day. May I return home, sir? I need you to do one more thing. I need you to put that line of trucks in the siding down that old line. It isn't very far. After that, you may go. All right, sir. I don't remember if he said this was a horror episode. I don't remember. Check and see if everything was okay. I hear the leaf blowers again in the background, but they're too far, so I think we're good. I wonder where this leads. And then you take it. <laughs> station I say what a most interesting find a nice place to get out of this dreadful rain it doesn't even look that run down I will have to share this with the others tonight Yeah, I was about to say, wasn't there something off to the side? Looks like Lady. The locomotive that that's Lady. I don't remember. But I remember those cap windows. Is that an excavator? <laughs> Hi, Toad. <laughs> I tell you, it's a fine-looking ship. You won't catch me in it. No telling how many animals are roosting in the ceiling. I don't want my paintwork to become a dark brown if you catch my meaning. Well, I do say it is an interesting find. I would ask why not stay here. I'm not sure that the branch it's on is designed to hold your weight, Gordon. You could get stuck there if you are not careful. Ah, a shelter is a shelter. It would definitely be better than sleeping out in the rain. Perhaps, but I still don't think it is a good idea. Who knows how long it has been there. It could collapse on you if another one of these storms hit. By the time another storm hits, this job will be long finished, and my berth waiting for me here. Hmm. Interesting. What is the purpose of the windmill in the, in the series? Nobody's ever been able to explain it. How did that track break? <laughs> oh yeah, the landslide. Central Island Quarry.
Hey, Oliver. Lads, how are you holding up? We cleared the majority of the debris around the line and sidings, but the large tree blocking the line is too big for us to move. We are going to need Rocky, but he is helping repair the suspension bridge until tomorrow. Henry took a train off Cutwood to Crosby, and will return with Rocky in the morning. So, what brings you to this part of the island? I was at Napford when the storm hit. It washed away some of the treks on the Little Western, so Sir Topham Pat has been sending me around to do different jobs. Had to deliver some small goods for your operation up here. Splendid. We were running low on oil for Terrence. Thank you, Oliver. At this rate, we might have it all done by tonight. All right, everyone, stop packing it up. All right, you three, change your plans. Part of the storm has turned around and is coming back. What? We need you all to move these trucks back into the siding. Just what I thought this was almost over. Calm down, Gordon. It isn't that bad. There aren't many trucks. It will only take an hour for this lot. You'll be home soon. And watch, he's gonna sleep in the shed. And he's gonna get stuck. last of it. Come now, Gordon. We don't want to get caught in a storm. You go on, Edward. Oliver and I will be staying tonight in the shed. I don't think that is a good idea, Gordon. That storm is coming back and that shed doesn't look that sturdy. If it held out once, it'll hold out again. I'll see you in the morning. Alright, then. Take care. <laughs> it's not gonna end well. Is it? Bracing the Storm, I remember this theme. I don't even know if that's the name of it, but it's the episode where Percy had to go through the rain. I don't even think that's the name of it. It's Edward. It's really hard to see him. <laughs> My word, this is not a downfall. Maybe it would be better to rest in the sheds I find. Is that Hank? That's Hank. I can't remember now. Where were they bonking? Some old shed that got him found in the woods. Hmm. I wouldn't want to be in the woods during this. Strange things can happen. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Just some stateside superstition. So what are you doing up here? I thought you went back home. Yeah. My boat was delayed due to the darn storm. Sir Topham had me do some deliveries until it was ready to sail again. I see. Well, it is late, so I'd better go to sleep. <laughs> no worries. It's just nodding off myself. Hmm. I always forgot that Hank was an American engine. Wasn't the first American engine to appear in the show, but an American engine no less. It took me until I watched Victor Transic's uh, World War II series to realize that Rosie was a American built engine. I just never noticed. I never took into heed that some engines were built otherwhere and they were just imported. Never crossed my mind. Yeah, that's a lady. <laughs> Willie. He has been obsessed with finishing this job so he can pull the express. I'll bet. Strange. Expected Gordon and Oliver to be up and running at this point. They may have slipped in. You go and get them, and I'll get Rocky ready. 
Sure thing. They're not even in the shed, are they? Gordon? Oliver? Why aren't you ready to get to work? What's wrong, Edward? Why have you stopped? Ominous. close by and there he goes Oliver wait up oh, chase team here we go god I love this theme I think I have every theme in the show this one is the most iconic it's the one of the few most memorable ones to older fans at, le at least to me it is shame that they didn't continue using it in the CGI series Or in the later um, model series se uh, seasons. Edward, slow down! Scrap me! That was close. What on earth was that? I'm not sure. Let's head back. We can figure this out from there. Oh, the buffers. But I didn't hear any sound. Now I know that this will be hard for some of you to hear, but now that standard services have resumed, we need other engines to handle goods and express duties. But, sir, aren't we just giving up on them? No, Thomas. We are still searching. I have been assisting the search and rescue in our coordinated search for Gordon and Oliver. But now that the lines are cleared, the express must run. With standard services resuming, we must get the railway running again. Have they found anything yet, sir? Not a trace. This is ridiculous. How can two engines just disappear? I don't know. It's unbelievable. They have to still be somewhere. They can't just be gone. You said you saw Oliver, didn't you, Edward? Yes. I saw Oliver, but he seemed to vanish. Oh, blow it out your smoke box! Engines can't run through a boulder at the size of their wheels. Edward angry. I don't like it here anymore. Come along, Percy. Let's go to Farquhar. I think I'll go find another shed, too. <laughs> yeah, they've never they've never truly seen Edward angry. In the show, or I think in the books. I know what I saw. I don't know what I witnessed.
still got a ways to go. What could be going on? Oh, Howdy here comes Hank. Edward. Oh, Hank. I didn't expect to see you there. I thought you had already went home. No. Ship leaves this afternoon. I just came to get a line of trucks. Ah, I see. So Topham is wanting to get as much use out of you as he can. Yes. I can imagine why. Won't be long before you're hearing some new whistles on the railroad. Very strange, though. I never got used to it in the States. Is that so? Yes. I used to work on a railroad in Oregon. Sometimes, engines and hikers would just vanish. No trace of them. Just gone. What happened to them? That's the disturbing part. Nobody knows. Can't convict a murderer with no evidence. Mm. Eventually, they just started calling it the missing 411. What do you suggest we do? 411. What do you say? Stay out of the forest. Oh, stay out of the forest. Mm. Maybe I should stay up for tonight. Oh my god, <laughs> staying with me, Edward. Yes, Philip. Philip, that's his name. <laughs> oh, we can swap stories, play games, tell secrets. If it's all the same to you, I think I'm going to go to sleep. Oh, okay. Who is that? <laughs> Gordon? Oliver? Hello, old friend. Oh, wait, we there's a lady at the end. What do you mean? We will be waiting for you where hard things are unearthed and heavy things are retrieved. Some creaking. Gordon's possessed. Gordon? Come on, Edward. Let's go see where he's going. Strange. Definitely ominous. Probably going back to the forest. What is the point of that windmill? I'm so good. They never explained it. Never. <laughs> it was just there for show at this point. Is that Diesel 10? Yeah, that's Diesel 10. And who is the guy standing behind him? I recognize that color scheme anywhere.
Wait, the red will glow. Is this a continuation? From the forest episode? What the hell? into the runaway ditch. We put up a cross on the railway tracks. A cross? Oh. Yeah, definitely some sort of possession. Okay, that sounds coming from the video. I thought it was coming from outside. Wait, I don't remember those fence fences being there. Oh, they completely closed it off. Hi, Caroline. is going on here. Oh, they set up cameras. The storm theme, that's the word one I was looking for. Huh. There's probably going to be something else, so I'm not going to be clicking off of anything. It's getting dark out in the camera. It's a lot of music, a lot of effects. What's going on with the camera? all green. Oh, probably night vision. Oh, shoot. Ah! Okay. 
That was definitely an ominous one. <laughs> to tell you the truth. Um, don't know what to make of that ending. Actually, I don't even think I've read the. I didn't even read the description, didn't I? Okay. After a storm left the island in ruins, the engines began cleaning the lines to get the run railway up and running. However, when the engines go into the forest, not everyone comes out. Nothing is in the video blocks. Okay. So not much of an explanation in the description. But he's probably going to follow up with another one in a couple of months. Because this, he said this is a part of a series he's doing. And the red glow was associated with the Henry's Forest video. Which was the main staple of the entire video. And the red glow appearing in here again. Means that somehow something else is going on. But that's my own assumption. You guys can make your own assumptions in the comment section. Um, with that being said, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's reaction video. I will be recording a lot more videos as to, as the April goes on. So just to catch up with everything I lost the time in March. And Jedi Survivor will be coming out this month. So I'll be playing that. I didn't react to this to the story trailer, so because I don't want to be spoiled by anything, but I know that some of the crew is back from the first game. Uh mainly the Knight Sister. I didn't watch the trailer, so I I don't plan on watching the trailer because of spoilers, but I won't I will be playing the game in the future because I'm currently replaying uh Jedi Fallen Order as we speak. And actually by the time this video comes out, I had just passed the part where I had ended my Jedi Fallen Order series on for like four, almost four years ago now. Actually, four years ago now. Exactly. I st stopped recording in uh, March, I think. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's reaction video. As that bus goes by, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.